MTA workers are dedicated to keeping the city moving through the pandemic. CBS News Dig Brennan highlights one worker who has been on the job for decades and is marching in today's parade. For more than half of his 21 years with the MTA, this is where Kenneth Mendez has come to do his job at 207th Street on the A line, making sure subway cars are clean and safe. Like the rest of the city, the early days of the shutdown found this underground to be eerily quiet, but still his work continued. While this was going on, you know, like, like when the city was, 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 was literally empty, the workers were out here you know, making sure that everything was still running on schedule, running on time, making the best of a bad situation. Among MTA workers, as with everyone else, there was a fear of this insidious virus, and the MTA suffered a heavy toll. This is New York. We we take a lick and we keep on ticking. You just gotta, when, when, when everything was closed down, we had to figure out what to do. And now everything's slowly, because we did the right thing and everybody wore masks and stayed, stayed away from each other. Before the pandemic, Mendez says he was pretty much invisible to riders, but now all of that has changed. Since this all went down, I've seen people, like a lot more people like come up to me and, and say, you know, like, uh, thanks a lot for what you, the work you're doing or, you know, um, how's everything going? You know, before it was just like getting on and off the train. And he's thrilled to have been selected to march in the parade. I'm very uh, proud to represent the New York City and the Transit Authority. Mendez says this is his first ticker tape experience, missing out on another momentous only in New York celebration decades ago. My brother and father went when the Mets were in the World Series in 1986, they went and I was still too young, and I still remember that how I wanted to go, and they said, no, I couldn't go. But riding in the Canyon of Heroes today, he's making up in a big way. He was among the first of the MTA employees to get vaccinated at Javits. We finished work, and I jumped, and I took the train, I went right downtown. He's grateful his family is healthy and happy to be celebrating today with the city. To me, it's gonna be like a wow moment, because, you know, this is a, for me, it's like a once in a lifetime opportunity, and, you know, now we're getting uh, sort of like pat on the back of, you know, job well done.